defense seemed to really take advantage of it. Well, we do mistake. stupid things, you know. We do <laughs> stupid things. We intercept the ball on, on fourth down on the two-yard line, so we got to go, what, 90-whatever yards. 96. I can't add very well. Penalties killed us, we, and there were penalties. You got guys grabbing face masks with 30 yards on that one drive, you know. Uh, we just do, sometimes we're not very smart, that's all. And just like in the end, you know, that little hook and ladder thing, we do that ourselves. Yeah. Did you know that they had that? We knew they had in that play, but obviously in the heat of the game, the kids were all excited and want to stop the kid. I mean, it was a perfect call by them, you know. They're, they're a well-coached team, and uh, I have a lot of respect for, uh, you know, we played them before. And third time's a charm. They beat us yes. twice before, so we're hanging on that third time's a charm. But So what are you thinking then after they get the onside kick? But well, I'm not thinking real good things. I probably couldn't tell you what I was thinking, you know, but uh, and our kid had the ball and let us, he just missed it, you know, which stupid things that we do, you know. So we knew they were going to onside kick it because they only had one timeout left. And, uh, you know. But the defense, you know, really held for the most part all game. Well, when they, the when they had to, yeah, they came up with big plays. But like in the first quarter, if you remember back, they had the ball almost seven minutes. So our offense only gets a ball for a little close to five minutes, and we took it down and scored. So about halfway through the first first half, we'd only had the ball once. And I think you have to have the ball to score, you know. And uh, so, yeah, they played pretty well. They stopped them from scoring, but they let them go up and down the field all the time, you know. And we got to have the ball, you know. It's our thing is scoring. And we got to have the ball. They didn't have the ball either. I think the first half was like three possessions for each other, which is pretty amazing. Their possessions were a lot longer than ours. <laughs> um, the play that really I thought gave you some separation there was the corner route on uh, yeah, Chad. Yeah, yeah. Uh, that was a third and 12 or something? Yeah, it was third and 12, and we were talking about possibly kicking a field goal, which we don't want to do. But uh, uh, and luckily, we ran an in and out. And he was wide open in the corner, and Nick got the ball, had good presence to get the ball to him, and Chad caught it. Yeah, it was a big play. We just knew that the team would eventually get exhausted. And the runners were hard, and we were just trying to get everybody out of the game. <laughs> um, well, they didn't have that quickness it looked like that they were used to. Uh, can you see them, you know, you guys jumping on some fumbles? What were you seeing? Out of them? We were just seeing them just working. Like, they, they, they wanted this game, we wanted this game, and we just worked a little bit harder than them. So. Defensively, you guys have come a long way here since the start of the year. What's, what's the key? The key is just us not giving up. Our defense, we all, we all just go in there with a nasty attitude. We all, we're jerks to each other at school, and then we should prove how good we are out here on the field. We, we all want the best stats out here. <laughs> you have to uh, kind of suck it up to keep it together after I mean, the events that happened. That, you know, all of a sudden they got the, the chance to play out the game. game. But thank you. Our coach tells us just something bad happened, just suck it up and you hit someone harder in the mouth the next play. So that's how we've just been playing this whole year and hopefully we can keep playing longer in this game. So. Uh, really, really proud of them, uh, especially to respond because when you come and you, you're down 14 nothing at halftime, uh, it can get really ugly in the second half. We didn't, they didn't allow that to happen. So. I'm sorry, extraordinary call on the, uh, the hook and ladder there. Was there something you saw that they're over pursuing that uh, you went for that play? No, uh, you know what? I mean, we've used that year after year, not year after year. We haven't actually probably ran that in probably 10 years, but we run that. Uh, there were some guys I said that I was thinking of some kid from the young men that we had from 90, uh, 92 team, and we used to hit that with a couple times. So we, we just put that in. Uh, you got to have that kind of play to maybe open something up. You know, there's various things you can do, but that's one we had. And I was I was really happy that they executed and got it because you know again it's just it's just a characteristic of them coming through at the time when they needed to. And, uh, yeah, it was sweet to see that. Yeah. And the onside kick was about as pretty. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, you know what? We, I, we, like everybody else, I suppose, we practice that every week. We practice different things, uh, all of our specialties, because specialties are what they are, specialties, and the way they turn out as a game. So, yeah, we had the opportunity there and got the drive going, and then, like you said, the flag was uh, was unfortunate at that time because uh, the kids were really looking, uh, really looking good. We had things on our side. Yeah. Can you tell us about the, uh, the, uh, the, uh, um, the one-two punch of Paco and Klein in the backfield? Uh, them? Well, yeah, they, you know, obviously you can tell that in the, 
in the first half. With, we couldn't get our running game going. I mean, they're, they kind of outmanned us up front. And uh, so we, we normally have a very strong running game, but we weren't able to do that very well today. So we had to get to some other things. He had made some great plays running and, and just creatively got some yards for us. But uh, for them, yeah, same thing. They were pretty physical up front, and they, uh, they ran the... Uh, <laughs> that ball down our throats quite a bit. Yeah. Did the field uh, affect you guys? Uh, field? No, no, no. The, the field was. I, I, I told Jim before the game. Jim France. Uh, yeah. I, the, this is fantastic. Too. You know, we were nervous coming down here because we think, well, other schools are changing and going to turf, and you know, why don't we go to green or something? But uh, you know, you get down here and see this. It, 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 the, the surface was fantastic. It's tough. I mean, wanted to win. Wanted to give the seniors another game. Wanted to keep playing with them. But I can't be more proud than them, of them. And we gave it our all second half. We came out ready to play. I've got to give it to them. They're a heck of a team. But I'm sad it's over, but nothing we can do. Well, refresh my memory. What win did you guys get right at the end? 7 uh, nothing. Independence. Independence. When you get wins like that, the close ones, when you get, how much did that help your confidence going into that last drive? Uh, I, felt, I felt very confident going through. I knew we could do it. I knew we had a chance. It came up a little short, but yeah. I mean, we all had our heads held high, ready to go. <laughs> That's right. We talk about this being a game of inches. When you look at it, uh, you know, a turnover in the first, the first quarter down there, you know, um, you know, turnover and downs, and then, you know, does that just really exemplify what the top post is going to be? Yeah, it really does. I mean, one penalty here or there, and we could have had a first down, could have been in the end zone. Could have scored down there too, so it's a big, big part of it. What do you say about the character of this team? You've got so few numbers this year, injuries, and you still got the playoffs. It shows amazing, like character in our team. How hard we're going to battle, how hard or how badly we want it, and how hard we're working in the offseason, how hard we're going to work.